me. My sister and I never felt appreciated by my dad because he would always put girls first. We'd be at dinner and he would be on his phone swiping on girls on Tinder. I've seen a temper in my dad multiple times. One time he was verbally abusive to me to the point that it was so loud that the neighbors had to knock on the wall to have us quiet down and he held me down. And he kind of like laid on me and was like holding me down, like yelling at me, like really close to my face. Another fight we had was over my sister and I's birthday weekend. He had told us specifically that there were gonna be no boyfriends except the three of us. He invited a girl that my sister and I didn't know, which was hypocritical because he had just told us that it was just gonna be the three of us. We were in the car afterwards and he asked if I had fun. And I said, no, I didn't have fun. You paid all of your attention to this random girl. But it escalated very quickly into an argument and just screaming and I was bawling my eyes out. The fight ended when I was telling him that my stepdad felt like more of a dad to me than he did. And it's the last time my sister and I have seen him. I don't speak to my dad and I haven't spoken to him for eight months. I feel in my heart that I don't want a relationship with my dad. He should have learned how to parent his kids correctly. He thinks that my sister and I want to see him and he is putting all of this blame on my mom. None of this is my mom's fault. The reason my sister and I feel the way that we do is because of his actions alone. Well, thank you guys for being here. I'm loath to pull children into the middle of a tug of war between divorced parents. And I only do this in this situation because of two things. One, you're already there. And what I want to do is get you out. And two, you're very mature young ladies. So do you not right now want to have a relationship with your father? Do you both feel the same way or do you have different levels of, of animosity? I think we feel the same yeah. about not, like as of right now, neither of us want to see him. And how do you feel? I haven't wanted a relationship with him since we stopped talking in March and it hasn't changed. And why did you stop talking in March? What happened? Uh, we got into a big fight over what we were doing so I wanted to go to a funeral and he said I couldn't go because it was a family weekend so I was like okay that's fine so then we went bowling just the three of us and a girl showed up that we had never met and I was very upset and I told him that and it was just a big argument I told him that my stepdad felt more like a dad to me in that moment than he did I can tell you as a dad that hearing someone say this guy's more of a dad to me than you are, would be, I mean, that's like driving a stake through the heart of any father. Mm -hmm. Did you say that to inflict pain on him in that moment? Were you really no. angry and? No, I never meant it to inflict pain on anybody. I just said what I was feeling in the moment and what I felt was that he wasn't being the dad that should be there when someone else is. But in retrospect, you understand that